Amanda Kenseth is live at the Coastal Dance Center studio in Merle's Inlet where young dancers are rehearsing for a Nutcracker production. Okay, so young ballerinas, they are busy preparing for this weekend's Nutcracker. Yes, News Channel 15's Amanda Kinseth is out in Merle's Inlet. She's at the Coastal Dance Center studio with the ballerinas rehearsing. Good morning, Amanda. Good morning. That's right. And talk about young. The youngest performer is three and a half. This is Eva, and this is Elizabeth Ann, and you're 10? Yeah, and the ages go up to, you know, 13, 14. Um, so they're doing the Nutcracker. Tell us a little bit about the story. What is the Nutcracker? It's about Clara and um, Drossmeyer comes in and she, and he gives him, she gives her this Nutcracker. And then later on in the story, the, the happens the battle scene when like the Nutcracker comes to life and then comes the Mouse King. And then we have the Snow Queen and the Snowflakes and then we, the Nutcracker and Clara, they go to the land of the sweets and we go, yeah, they the, go all to the sweets. The land of the there. sweets, that sounds like a fun place. I'd like to be there, huh? Yeah. Are you a fan of sweets? Yeah. <laughs> now, how long have you been dancing? Since I was two. Since you were two. So you're only 10, you've already been dancing eight years. Is ballet your favorite? Yeah. yeah. You like it a lot. Well, um, I'd like you to look at the camera and invite everyone to come out and see you this weekend. Come see the Nutcracker this weekend. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> How can you How say no to that, right? right? How can you not come see the show? Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> She's a natural. Those little adorable ballerinas are going to give us sneak peeks throughout the show. So <laughs> you can see the actual show, the Coastal Youth Ballet Nutcracker production, this Friday through Sunday at the Myrtle Beach Community Church Auditorium. Yeah, and Ed Piotrowski, he's going to be there, a part of it too as well. Show, yes. So, pretty neat. There are some things that go hand in hand with the holiday season, like the Nutcracker. News Channel 15's Amanda Kinseth is live at the Coastal Dance Center studio in Merle's Inlet, where ballerinas are rehearsing for this weekend's Nutcracker production put on by the Coastal Youth Ballet. Good morning, Amanda. Good morning, that's right. It's a fantastic holiday show. You need to go out there and watch it. You will see Hannah performing. And Hannah, who are you in the Nutcracker this year? Clara. Okay, and who is Clara? Well, Clara's a young little girl who, her family throws a party for Christmas and her godfather, Drossmeyer, comes to bring gifts for the family and then a um, Nutcracker who comes to life and battles the Mouse King and they take a really, really, really magical journey to the land of the sweets. And you've, um, you've been in the Nutcracker mm -hmm. a lot, countless times. You can't even remember how many times. How excited are you to be Clara this year? Extremely excited. <laughs> that is exciting. Well, can you show me um, a little move? Can you show me, you know, what, what, what ballet move can you show me? Something simple um, that I could do. Simple? Yeah, or, you know, a warm-up move. Um... Maybe just a plie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. How am I doing so far? Good. Yeah. Now, how how bad do your toes hurt after really dancing bad. all day? Really, really bad. <laughs> do you have to get out and give yourself a little foot massage after the show? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> a lot. They hurt. <laughs> All right, well, we're all excited to come see you uh, perform the Nutcracker. And are you ne nervous, excited? How are you feeling? Well, I mean, I'm excited, but I'm really nervous because I've never done it before as Clara. Well, you're going to do great. Thank you. <laughs> it's going to be a great show. You don't want to miss it. Just going on this weekend. And you're, ver you're very graceful, too, Amanda, out there. I didn't know you could do it. <laughs> Thank you. Maybe I'll get a spot in next year's show. Right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> exactly. She'll blend right in with the little ones, yes, right? Yes, she will. No, the Coastal Youth Ballet Nutcracker Productions this Friday through Sunday at the Myrtle Beach Community Church Auditorium. Practicing for the Nutcracker. The performance is coming up this weekend, and uh, let me tell you, it's something you won't want to miss. Stick around for details. So News Channel 15's Amanda Kinseth is giving us a little bit of a holiday treat this morning. Yeah, we're getting ready for the big Nutcracker production mm -hmm. put on the, by the Coastal Youth Ballet. And you're at the Coastal Dance Center Studio in Merle's Inlet with some of the young ladies who are so impressive, Amanda. They are. They are amazing dancers. It's going to be a fantastic show this weekend. And now I'm with Kylie. And uh, who are you in the Nutcracker? I'm the Sugar Plum Fairy. The Sugar Plum Fairy. All right. So what does that mean? Um, it means that I'm like 
that's the lead role in the Nutcracker, and it's um, it's really like an honor to be it. It's like the top. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. you must be a really good dancer then. <laughs> <laughs> you are. I've seen you moving around. How long have you been dancing? Um, since I was six for 11 years. Okay, yep. and uh, do you do just ballet? Yeah, mainly, yeah. Okay, so as a six-year-old when you started, did you think one day I want to be the lead role in the Nutcracker? Um, I've been doing the Nutcracker since we started here, and I never thought that I'd be here today. I mean, I started out as a bonbon and a candy cane, so... <laughs> Great. Well, lots of hard work. Now, how how much have you guys been practicing? You guys have been practicing for months, yeah. right? Um, we started in um, in the summer, and then we really start rehearsing in like August, and we come here like six days a week, sometimes seven. So, it's a lot of work. Okay. So, do you dream about the Nutcracker? Oh too? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever had to practice this early in the morning? No, never this early. <laughs> it's a little tough, isn't it? <laughs> I hope you don't have a full day ahead uh, of you. I have to go to school, but that's it. <laughs> yeah, maybe try to schedule in a nap time here or there. Um, so, can you show me a ballet move? Something uh, not too hard? Something maybe I can try to do? Because uh, the Nutcracker's cool. Maybe I can be like a, a sub for <laughs> next year, you know? I can be on standby in case somebody needs it. Um, would you like to try an arabesque? Okay. You just go like this and just put your leg up. I said something easy. All right, <laughs> like that? How's yeah. that? All right, do you think I could get, you know, like oh, a, yeah. a small roll? <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite thing about performing that cracker? Um, it's like a tradition now, because I've done it for so long, so it's like, it brings in like the holidays, and like it really gets you like in the spirit, and you know, Christmas is right around the corner. <laughs> and Ed Piotrowski is gonna be in the yeah. show, is that right? Tell yep. me a little bit about that. Who's um, he gonna be? He's gonna be Mother Ginger. There's a different, um, guests that's gonna perform as Mother Ginger in each show and I think it's a good thing and it's a good way to like bring the community. So. Yeah, that's awesome. So not only will you see these amazing ballerinas perform but Ed Piotrowski will be out there too and that is something, I don't know about you guys but that's something that I don't wanna miss. No, you don't wanna miss that and she makes it look so easy and this is all you do Amanda and then <laughs> I don't know how they do it. They just of course, have they've been, long, yeah. beautiful limbs. They've been training their whole lives yeah. for years. And she made a good point. This is very early for them because they have a lot yeah. of preparation. So thanks to all the cutie pies. Yeah, they went to, and then the, the little young one, uh, a couple hits ago, she was like, <gasps> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Waving the tears away from the yawns. Uh, well, you can catch the show, The Nutcracker Productions, happening at the Myrtle Beach Community Church Auditorium. It's this Friday mm -hmm. through Sunday. There's a lot of different shows. Next on Good Morning Carolinas. I am practicing for the Nutcracker. Now, I'm not going to be in it, but these dancers are. They are wonderful ballerinas, and it's going to be a great show. The yeah. Coastal Youth Ballet is gearing up for their big holiday show this weekend, the Nutcracker. We've yeah. been checking in with Amanda Kinsa. She's live out there. That's right. Amanda's there in Merle's Inlet. She's at the dance studio, uh, hanging out with the kids as they get ready for the big weekend show. That's right, and this is dun, 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 the Nutcracker, which is really exciting. Normally, you know, they do this performance each year, and normally they bring in a guest artist for that. But this year, it is someone local. Brock, you are the Nutcracker. How is it going? It's good. It's <laughs> good. Now, you've actually never danced before. No, I only started in the summer, and this is my first Nutcracker actually dancing. Okay. So. And they're working it's, you hard, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you've been practicing a lot to get ready for the performance, and uh, your brothers are in the performance too. Yeah. yeah um. They're they're not here, yeah. but <laughs> they're sleeping. They're yeah. still in bed. <laughs> <laughs> but there's actually one dance where it's just the three of us, which is the Russian dance for the candy canes in the land of sweets, and we do that just three of us. Very so. cool. What's been the hardest thing for you to learn how to do so far? Probably partnering because it's a lot of lifts and yeah. Well, I saw I saw what you guys were doing and your <laughs> yeah. dance. Well, you're doing a phenomenal job Thank you. and uh, very exciting to get ready for that. So, do you like nuts? Mm, sometimes, <laughs> some of them. <laughs> sometimes the Nutcracker and it will be going on this weekend. It's going to be a great performance, a great way to get in the holiday spirit, guys. Hey, we like nuts. I like nuts. Absolutely. Do you like nuts? Absolutely. That's are good. Especially this time of year. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you can check out the Nutcracker production. It's Friday through mm -hmm. Sunday at the Myrtle Beach Community Church Auditorium. Yeah.